backstory, man. It's pretty cool if you're actually like into like the Star Fox lore. Ain't no Falco on stream though, not yet. Looking like we are starting it out with the Diddy Kong in here. Yoshi versus Diddy. Not as common of a matchup as it used to be, but we're gonna see what helpers Diddy is gonna be able to do against the Pharaoh Menace in himself. One of the highest seeds, I believe number one seed of this tournament, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Yeah, actually, that doesn't make sense considering that he did just win. Like, that he would get like a very high seed. But, um... Yeah. It definitely looks like he's trying to prove it. Like, we saw how help, how dominant Helper was versus Elfin, and it feels like now he's forced to play on the back foot, and only like getting like nick having to nickel and dime power rather than doing those big extensions, like he's kind of famous for. Yeah, you know, I mean, I feel like a lot of those combos that Helper has will definitely still work on Yoshi, but at low percentage, he's just got to be really, really careful, man. I mean, uh, Yoshi's kind of like, oh no, not already. Uh, whoa, oh my God, what kind of he, was he, he going? For something like fancy there, or I actually can't even analyze. I, I don't. I can't even analyze that. I can't tell it, what he was going for. It kind of looked like one of those times in the uh, in like high school where they give you like a little bit of warning, like you know you're a little bit a little bit bad during lunch period. They, they, the the lunch lady wags your finger at you. It's like next time you go into detention. Yeah, it's like it looked like it should have been a bigger punish, but it just yeah. it just wasn't because they didn't want to discipline a child that hard. <laughs> I don't know. Either way, though, wow. that forward air does not take the stock. Yoshi is a very heavy boy. Second one's going to do it, though, especially in that beautiful position by the ledge. Ooh, picks his, uh, yeah, he picked up his banana a little bit too lag laggily, and uh, Pharaoh just came off the angel platform. Like, uh, like a god descending from the, to his people, taking the <laughs> stock. Uh, from the purple Yoshi rain down on high. The hidden, <laughs> one from Yoshi, the hidden one from Yoshi's island, as it was foretold in the scrolls. Anyway. <laughs> Some people have Elder Scrolls, we have the Yoshi Scrolls. <laughs> we got the Yoshi Scrolls out here. Just whipping out these back airs though, man, and it's just... He, he's stuffing out, like, uh, Helper's monkey flips with those as well. I don't know if you saw that, because... My god, Pharaoh, like, he's gonna take a good utilization of that move, because Yoshi's back air is just... Huge. Uh, that, that move is a very, very big hitbox move. I mean, it's not... I don't think it's the biggest one out of his, all of his aerials that might go yeah. to his up air. But, like, either way, it's just a very good one to stuff out approaches. And speaking of approaches... We got extensions, aerial ones, on the part of Helper right there, but it uh, just turned out to be overextensions. Yeah. Barrow is mashing down B out of that situation. I'm gonna take the yeah, stock that, for it. That down B is especially scary because like it can go through platforms, so like you can mix up like so much with it, uh, whether like to do it at all or even just like whether to land on platform or like go through the platform. Oh, I will never Ooh. forget that, dude. The first set of Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Oh my wow. god, stuffing out his approach with the dunk, my god. I love aggressive options to counter, uh, edge guards. Especially if you play a character with, you know, as amazing of airspeed as Yoshi, you know, like, it just, it's a, it's such a sick looking way to stuff out, like, to stuff out bad edge guards and bad approaches on the part of Pharaoh. It was a really cool thing to see. Yeah. But, uh, let me guess, Kloon hit you with the, uh, the down beat through platform. Wasn't even Kloon. Wow, okay. It was literally the first set of Smash Brothers Ultimate mm -hmm. that I ever played. Like, it was when the game first dropped. It was like the first local for it. It was my round one. Some Yoshi didn't know what his name was. And he took a he took a game off of me because and one of the things that he kept catching me with was I'll be through the platforms. And I'm like, okay, Yoshi can do that now. Yeah, it's, That's it's such like, a scary buff. It's, it's so weird because, like, he's never been able to do that. And the punish never. has always been the same. He went under platform, he, he, he down bees, and then you up air him through the platform. And Yoshi's one of the original 12 characters, too, man. He's, like, yeah. uh, fighter number five, if I'm not mistaken. So, uh, the fact that he's been in the series for, like, literally 20 years at that point, and they never changed that move, and they decided to do it for this game. So, Scary, so he's man. Cinco de Smash Bros. Good Cinco de Smash Bros., yes. <laughs> throwing, out, throwing out these eggs, gonna make some uh, Spanish omelets. You ever have those, like, uh, tortilla española? I... Really want? I might have had one in the past, but I I really want one now. They gotta Dude. open up the restaurants, man. But well, to, when it's safe, like when it's safe, too. Of course, go to a tapas place. Speaking of being safe, Looking that like double jump not looking like it. <laughs> yeah, helper just sending him right back down to the town to send him to a tapas place. Beautiful place down there. Landing all he's been landing those all night, man. Yeah, just quarantining him to the blast land. Jesus. Yeah, but now he's up a stock, and now this is when the Yoshi has to approach. And Yoshi, if you're the one who's up against Yoshi, you can play in such a way, or you should play in such a way, where you can make his approach options relatively telegraphed. 
Like, yeah, he's got the best airspeed in the game, but if you're the one who's up and you know what Yoshi is going to do on the way in, which it's looking yeah. like Helper does right now, just hitting him with three uppies in a row, you can make it really, really hard for Yoshi yeah. to get really any leeway on you. Especially, like, a smaller character like Yoshi, uh, I'm sorry, like, um, <laughs> like Diddy, yeah. where, like, you can kind of, like, treat it like, uh, like Belmont Axe and, like, hot, go under the arc, uh, and just, like, crouch under it to, like, to force his, uh, like, landing options to get free anti airs Right. Yes, yeah, Helper right now really run away with this lead. Has him at 140. He has to watch out for down tilt back here, but able to get that up here. Smash ultimate spot dodge canceling, my friend. My man just could have lost his stock for it off of uh, Helper's down smash, but he was, he was ready for it, spot dodge for it, and then was able to get a kill confirm off of it instead. Welcome to ultimate, my friends. I really like Barrel's how Helper's like utilization of, of like that up at a shield, because like that's something you only see from the other ditties. And like, in every match he's played, he's been able to like consistently hit, know when to hit it, and he's getting, gotten so much mileage out of it, even when it doesn't kill it. It's just getting him percent that like, did he's a character, like, any character with a kill throw, take, take him any amount of percent is dangerous, because you're just that much closer to them, just get, getting old man hands on, on you, and chucking you to where you belong. Mm, very true, my friend. So it's going to be on the part of Helper to see just how he's going to be able to keep Barrel off of him instead. And that can be... Oh, God. We're back good? We're good? Fair. All right, we're this fine. This man's innovating. Yeah. Never Maybe seen even making some inventions. Yeah, like if there's any like Yoshi to do IT it. Class. Yeah. I mean, if there's any Yoshi that's going to be able to do that, it's definitely Pharaoh. Definitely got a high grade in that IT class. Not like me. I think I got a C in my college one. <laughs> yeah, here's that the chat. Then. Yeah, that was then. This is now. Whatever. Anyway, he's the one who's up right now for a full stock, and he's the one who can spawn projectiles. So, oh, I love that play. I love that play the helper was going for off the level right there. Z dropping the banana. Z dropping the banana, double jump catching it with the down air. To just literally put out a second hitbox to try to get Pharaoh to actually get hit by the, uh, yeah. to get, to put Pharaoh and hit stun to get hit by the down air there. That was beautiful. Yeah, we, the we've all seen the, the Great so Wall practiced. of China, but the Great Wall of Helper looking a little bit more threatening in this day and age. Yeah. Making me hungry. Because you can't go around that. No. I mean, you can if you got uh, armor on your double jump. True, true. Yeah. Still not hasn't taken the game, though. It. No, not every character, man. And Helper still hasn't taken the game yet. Like I said, he's the one who's up. He's got a banana in and He's got the banana in hand, so theoretically, he should be able to keep uh, Pharaoh at bay as best as he can. But, like, the thing is, Pharaoh, I mean, in Yoshi, he's got, like, the best airspeed in the entire game. So, I mean, if he just plays his cards right, especially with, you know, the... Amazing speed and, you know, double jump progress that Pharaoh as a character has in Yoshi. He might be able to avoid these setups and just create some of his own. Especially it's, especially considering that he's already got Helper at, yeah. like, damn near 100% already. This is still anybody's game. Yeah, Pharaoh definitely kind of uh, starting to look for, like, that, those, those drag down back here. Because if it pops up, he gets a smash. And I've literally seen him do forward smash off of, like, when it does that little, like, drag down where you, get, where you slide across the ground. Like, when, when he gets spiked double percent. Wow, he just straight up died center stage. That was kind of interesting. That was like... That was dead center stage with a Diddy back air. Does kill Yoshi at 160. Yeah. Okay. It, really, that move is all knockback risk. Because like, it's a combo move at low percents and kill move at higher percents. Even better at killing than forward air. I feel like that, that's like Diddy's one weakness. Is that like... His, his forward air has a lot less uses because it doesn't hit as low as it used to. And it's not as active. Or, or kill as early. Evidently that and, not. And his throw game isn't as good. Yeah, evidently not. Like, so it was kind of looking like shades of like shades of Smash Four Diddy right there with how amazing his back air was before and out here just doing it again. I think we're running it back to town. It's looking like. Let's find out. Yeah, we are. Yeah, because yeah, okay. Fire was definitely doing good. He likes the platform hypes because he, because uh, not only can he like kind of camp off them, but they're so great for like Yoshi's extensions and combos. Again. Speaking of combos, almost dying to that. Nair down here. Not a second time, my friends. And I, I'm not even sure if at that percent, like, it would have armored through, you know, yeah. with uh, Yoshi's uh, double jump. I literally don't know. I feel like it would have at that low of a percent, but Diddy's down there is pretty powerful, so I'm not sure if it would have broken through the heavy armor. Yeah, the, the cartwheel of doom into the, uh, the, 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 bon the bongo bead down here. <laughs> and it's just as well. Yeah. It's just as well that Diddy's, you know, dash attack is as good as it is in this game, considering, you know, how amazing it is in Donkey Kong Country, you know? Good uh, banana forward smash. Taking the first stock, sitting pretty at only 30. What's the insurance yeah. policy? Already to only 23 really so like far. Really like the forward air trade. Try and alleviate the pressure, but 
Farrah right now kind of picking some risky options off disadvantage and Helper keeps calling him out. Can you get a good damage. reset? This is big, big damage. He's getting a lot of insurance on, uh, he's getting a lot of insurance while Helper was sitting pretty only on his first stock. That's huge. Can't describe yeah. how important insurance is in real life mm -hmm. and in Smash. This guy definitely aced his economics class. <laughs> oh, uh, clearly. Clearly, my dude. He, he's winning he's, in today's economy. Yeah, I mean, he's already just still on his first stock right now, and ever since then, he's lapped Pharaoh in percent already. This is looking pretty bad for the hometown hero and Pharaoh, and for the number one seed of this tournament, will Helper send him to losers right now? This would be a oh. mighty upset if Helper is able to close it out, but I want to yeah. ca call it Pharaoh because I've seen some, some nutty reversals from that man. Oh, we have. I mean, Farrell could definitely bring this back. There's a, there's a reason that, you know, we don't play just one stock or just one game here in yeah. Smash Brothers. I could never play a best of one game. I just, Imagine. I couldn't. I, I would be, A, too stressed and, like, how do you adapt to your opponent? I mean, don't become a don't become a Mario Odyssey speedrunner, then. <laughs> I guess so. Because <laughs> they just, yeah, you know, they play shot. the game for, like, an hour, and then that's it. Oh, but that's so much damage off of just one move and just one interaction. Think about it. If he did that two more times, the game would be even. True. Yoshi's down there, man. That I remember when so that down was first that invented. It did 54% of all the hits connected. Jeez, I remember. It was crazy in mind, of course, in the uh, 64. Yeah, but catching the landing of Pharaoh right there is Helper. He's going to be able to get that up smash out of shield, killing off the top of town and city. To take that uh, take that second stock off the part of Pharaoh, only needing one more to potentially yeah. make this upset, man. Yeah, Helper, Helper went for that same side B uh, extension like he did last time. Good call, good call out on Farrow to, you know, just immediately catch on to that. For sure, man. It's just going to be it's going to be all on Farrow here to take advantage of, like, how much better Yoshi is on the uh, in the air than on the ground. As that banana mm -hmm. forward smash takes the stock. Because I was going to say, Helper, if he was up, he's the one who should be able to play a good keep away game with his banana. But Farrow right there clutching it right when he had to, evening out the game. We're at last stock. Yeah, it was just surprising because, like, Helper had a huge, uh, a huge lead the entirety of the game. So, you know, as we were saying, like, you can't quite call out these top-level players um, quite yet. No, definitely not. But the banana coming in clutch for Helper right there, actually dropping it off of that interaction and making it so Pharaoh couldn't get any more damage. Coming yeah, in clutch for the hometown here. I really like how Pharaoh's kind of, like, essentially playing the Luigi match right now, just sticking on the, sticking on these platforms. Uh, and not letting, like... Help her go for any banana forward smashes or any other funky monkey business. Yeah, he's definitely playing the anti grab game, and now you see, now you see him playing the anti banana game instead because he knows that just one confirm is potentially all it takes. Yeah, you see, Pharaoh, he's trying to spend most of his time in the air right now because he definitely just does, he does not want to get tripped because he knows if he does that could definitely spell the end Ooh, of the that game. Could be bad, but he gets it anyways. That's going to take it even the last hit. Wow. What a cinematic way to end that game right there. Just getting the last tip of the up smash off of that banana exchange. And that is Helper with his Diddy advancing the top 16 winner side. Taking out the number one seed of the bracket. Yeah. And it's unfortunate because like a dri uh, like Drift, any other, like an air dodge, any other way could have gotten him out of that. Because he had that straight up calling him out. He was Unfortunate. Prepared. It was just the yeah. last hit. And why would he be prepared? Mm -hmm. Why would he? It's, who who is prepared to DI just the last hit of up smash if the first two whiffed like that? And the thing is, also, is he had to be careful because uh, uh, after the downer, D Diddy can immediately back here. So, like, he has to immediately air dodge and he has to pick which way to air dodge. Uh, and, and, like, it, he definitely was, uh, like, well advised in what he did, but Helper was just a step ahead of him.